In this video, you are going to learn how to check the ports of target machine. In the previous video, you saw how to check the status of target machine and also what is N mapping. Now, in this video, you are going to check the ports of target machine by N mapping. So, after checking the status of N mapping, the attackers try to check the information of the ports, means which all our ports can be used for attacking the server. Coming to the ports, there are six port states recognized by the nmap. First one is open. Security minded people know that each open port is an animus for attack. Attackers and pen testers want to exploit the open ports. So next one is close. Close port is accessible but there is no application listening on it. They can be helpful in showing that a host is up on an IP address. And the next one is filtered. The filtering could be from a detected firewall, routing rules, or post based firewall software. These ports frustrate the attackers because they provide so little information. And the next one is unfiltered. The unfiltered state means that a port is accessible, but Nmap is unable to determine whether it is an open port or closed port. And the next one is open filtered. Nmap places ports in the state when it is unable to determine whether a port is open or filtered. This occurs for scanning types in which open ports gives no response. And the last port is close filter. This state is used when the Nmap is unable to determine whether a port is closed or filtered. It is only used for the IP, ID, IDLE scanning. So now coming to my term X, here I am going to type Nmap and then I am going to enter my IP address that is 192.168.1.1100 then pressing enter now here you can see the open ports of my IP address ports status of the ports services so in this you can see all the TCP ports are open TCP is a transmission control protocol you can see the services and also you can see RTSP service that is RTSC service some typically HTTP request like the options requesting and next I am going to type nmap scan dot nmap dot org and then pressing enter and here it shows the all the services and ports present in the nmap dot org and also you can see here 993 ports are closed in this here you can see FTP ports, SMTP ports, HTTP and few more. You can see here HTTP ports is open and its port number is 21. We use FTP port to upload the files to the server. And also you can see HTTP ports port and its port number is 80 and filter SMTP. So this is how the attacker check the ports before doing any attacks. Make sure that your web application or your server can be secured by this type of ports. So that's on this video. Thank you.